guys, it's Jade here today, and today's video is actually a video that was like requested a couple months ago, but I kind of wanted to wait till I got a little bit more into the school year to do it. It is a what's in my backpack. I love watching these videos, you guys, like almost as much as I love watching school supplies hauls. And I really wanted to make it one for you guys. If you like my channel, please subscribe and click that notification bell down below. Please give this video a big thumbs up. If you're thinking, please comment it down below. I will be sure to read them and to reply to as many as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, so let's just get into it. Alright guys, so this is my backpack for the school year. This actually, I bought this at the beginning of the school year, and um, since it was a more expensive backpack, I'm planning to use it like all four years of high school. So this is the North Face Recon, and um, just the solid black, it's like the 2016 version, or whatever. I don't know, it was about $100, so it is pretty expensive, but the quality of this thing is amazing. Like, I love this thing, and like, there is so much padding. I have really bad, like, lower back problems, and there's so much padding on the straps and on the back, and like, all of these different, like, straps you can use for support. It really, really helps if you guys have back problems, and I just, I love this thing so much, and black goes with everything, so, yay. So we're just going to kind of start from the front. So in this front pocket, like, I don't know really what to do with this because, like, it's, I don't even know. So I just kind of put my pencil pouch in there. So this is my pencil pouch. It's Vera Bradley. My friend gave it to me. And I don't really know what I have in here. A lot of times I'll just kind of shove a pin right there. And that's what I use. I have $2. I have, oh, yeah, I put a couple of these in there because sometimes I get bored during English. And, like, one of my big, like, hobbies or whatever that I like doing is hand lettering. So I just picked out, like, five. I have Actually, I have six. I don't know where the other one is. Um, of these just kind of brush tip, dual tip markers or whatever that I have in there. I got this thing, which if you watch my school supplies haul, you would see this thing. Um, it's been like the best thing ever. And you guys should totally watch that school supplies haul. I will have like a little card come out right now or at some point in this video. or um, And I'll also have it linked down below. Uh, and it's like a monster. And then there's like post-it notes that you pull out. I thought that was kind of cute. And then... Um, I have this three pack of the Studler Tri, no, four pack of these Studler Triplus Fine Liners. And um, these I also use mainly for like hand lettering and stuff rather than note taking. But it's cool because they come in this plastic case and you can like undo it and then fold it back and then snap and it becomes a stand. Mind blown. I know. It's pretty awesome. I really like those. And then I have two of these blue Bic Atlantis pins, which is like the ones I actually use to do schoolwork. And then I have a yellow one of these too, but it's like in my room, of these like Sharpie highlighters. I actually just went and bought some more office supplies because like all the stuff I, I lost like a ton of my like pens and pencils and kind of like ran out of ink in a lot of my pens and pencils and stuff uh, from the beginning of the year. That's why like a lot of this is like wasn't in my school supplies haul. I either like had it and put it in here or just I recently went to Target and bought a couple things. So um, the Sharpie Clear View highlighters, I was very skeptical of these. I was like, this is just another gimmicky thing that Sharpie made to make us buy it. But like, actually the Clear View thing is like really, really helpful. And like, I hold my pencils really weird. And like, the shape of them, because they're kind of weird and like thin and long, um, really fits in my hand well. So I have an orange and a pink and a yellow, but the yellow's in my room. And what else is in here? Oh yeah, the last one of those blue ones, and then one of these little fox pencil things. And I usually have like the black and the red of these. There's probably somewhere else in my backpack. I honestly don't even know. Um, and I usually have my favorite pens at the time that I'm doing like everything with, which should be in this pocket. I'll just wait to show you until I get there. And then the next thing I keep in this pocket is just my graphing calculator. I got this bad boy in like sixth grade when I started pre-algebra. Yes, I'm a nerd. I took pre-algebra in sixth grade. Anywho, I'm taking Algebra 2 right now. It's quite difficult. And then in this front pocket right here is where I keep like all the stuff that I've pretty much used throughout the day. And so it's usually, it's supposed to be just for my phone and my headphones, but I end up putting like all this other stuff if I don't want to have to get out my pencil pouch. So of course I have my headphones, which I cannot live a day without headphones in school. Like it's, it's impossible. And then I have, this is my favorite pen that I'm using right now, you guys. It's so good. It is the Pentel Energel Liquid Gel Ink. Um, needle tip 0 0.7 and like it makes your handwriting look amazing and it's just so like black and crisp and beautiful oh my gosh it's snowing yes I live in Tennessee and like it never snows and I'm like really really wanting a snow day because like I am sleep deprived I literally have not gotten because this whole weekend was super busy because I'm filming on a Sunday right now and my entire week was just so tiring. Guys, I just need a break. I feel like the school systems don't understand that sometimes you just need a break. 
Anywho, next thing I have is this little mini stapler. I'm going to give you a mini stapler lesson right now. So, this is a mini stapler. This thing on the back, that's a staple remover. A lot of you probably knew that, but if you didn't, that's supposed to be a staple remover. But something most of you probably didn't know, this rubber piece on the bottom, if you peel it off, like peel like back on it, you store extra staples under there. Mind blown. Mind blown. All right, next I have an iTunes gift card that I got from my friend. It's kind of in there. Uh, and then I have the red version of that Bicket Lannis pen, and then like this came free with the pack that I bought of these. It's like the Bicket Lannis exact, so it's like a thinner point. It's, it's an okay pen. And then I have um, one of my mini whiteouts that I had got in my school space all, and then you know some trash. Now we're gonna move on to this. Oh my lord! Middle pocket right here. And so we got lots of things in here. This I don't need to lose. It's actually my registration for next year, so my respect for my items. Then I have this pencil pouch, which I was keeping in my locker for the longest time, but then I like started needing some of this stuff in here. I, it's kind of just like, ex, it's like, I don't know, it's like school supplies that like you don't always need all the time, so I just kind of keep it down in this pocket. And so it's just got two packs of little mini sticky notes. It's got, it had four binder clips on here, but I'm using one of them. So it's got these binder clips on that thing, and then it's got some tape. It's got these like really cute patterned scissors and a compass and protractor, which like I have not used a single time this year. We use it like every day in geometry, and then no, we haven't even touched it this year. Anywho, moving on. Um, then, so that's all I have like not in a pocket, and then all the rest is kind of organized in here. So in this first pocket right here, I used to have this like way differently organized, and like there was a ton of stuff in all of these pockets, but I tried to kind of condense and simplify my backpack a little bit, like before I went back over the, you know, that's why there's like not very much in here you know and then so I have this flexible ruler in there and then I don't have anything in there and then I have I just kind of opened up because the box is getting destroyed of these like erasable color pencils and just like, kind of put them all right there it's a very convenient spot then I just have this keychain that I got at Panama City Beach Florida when I went with my family over the summer and then in here is just kind of like not school supplies just like you no know, personal hygiene stuff there's like deodorant and lotion and chapstick and hair ties hand sanitizers feminine products. Um, moving on, we got nothing in that pocket, nothing in that pocket, in this pocket. I used to just kind of dump these all in my backpack and I was like, that's not, you know, okay, no. So I just put them in a little bag, they're like some colorful paper clips, and then I usually have some like backup, those like Fox pencils in here, because like guys, I never use pencil. I always use pen. Unless I'm taking a scan contest, I always use pen. Um, so that's why I just don't even own any pencils. And then I don't have a lot of stuff like in my backpack right now because I usually like I have a homework folder that I'll put my homework in instead of having to take home the binder for every subject and I do have a lot of homework but it doesn't like look like it. So first thing is I just have my copy of Lord of the Flies which is the awful book that we're reading right now and annotating and it's awful. Then I have my Latin workbook. Yay. Um, then I have, this is my planner, I was using that Kate Spade planner earlier, but it honestly just got destroyed, and I didn't have enough room to write in it, so I got this, like, for Christmas, I got this huge one that's just from Target, it was, like, probably seven or eight dollars, and it's super cute, it's marble. Then I have my Latin binder, Latin, guys, Latin. Then I have my Algebra 2 notebook, this is actually my second Algebra 2 notebook for this year already, and I'm uh, actually, I'm about to have to get a third, I only have like three or four pages left in this one, so, hmm, and then, I don't know why this is in here, this is my, the whiteout that's supposed to be on my desk, but whatever, and then I have my, in the like laptop pocket or whatever, I have my homework folder, which I did like pretty hand lettering, with my name on the front of it, but then it kind of like all rubbed off, and my, um, my homework, yay! And that's all for this pocket. Another really cool feature about this backpack is it does have like a really nice padded laptop sleeve. So when I have to take my laptop to school, it's very convenient. And now I'm going to kind of go on to the side pockets because I do have some stuff in the side pocket. So in this side pocket, my English project from a long time ago. Um, it used to be like folded up nicely and in this bag or whatever. But pretty much it's just like a little mini umbrella because I have some classes that are like outside, um, like you have to walk outside to get to a portable, and so when it's raining, that, and then, you know, trash, so, yeah, that is just about it for what's in my backpack.
Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up. And comment down below any other video... Got, oh, sorry. Sorry guys, I'm getting a little tongue tied. Um, any other video ideas you guys want to see on my channel? I know I've just been so inconsistent the past couple months. Like, I've uploaded in the past couple months, but it'll be like every other week or every two weeks like I haven't put uploaded in two weeks and I feel so bad you guys it's not that I don't see YouTube as a priority like YouTube is actually the most fun thing I do um, I love sitting in front of camera I love talking to you guys like photography is actually my life though like it is my hobby so I have studio lights and backdrops and cameras and all these sorts of things and I love you guys so much and this is my favorite thing that I get to do but when I'm in school and taking these hard classes and all the sports and the church events and everything, I, I just don't have time. And I know I could pro like make more time and that is my goal. So I just need some video ideas and I want to make video guys that you guys want to see. And I want to start taking more time for my videos and not just like, I love making sit down and talk videos like this one, but I want to make some really cool like super edited, like fun with music and all those sorts of things like that video. So just leave me some suggestions in the comment down below and I will hopefully get to them for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you guys next week, I promise. Bye guys.